Hello, today's subject is if uh, SOC 200 and OSDA certificate worth the money. Those are cars and uh, certificate from offensive security. Um, I will answer, or I hope I will, uh, who is it for, uh, why you should or shouldn't take it and pay for it. I recently passed uh, the certificate. Uh, I mean, passed the exam and got the certificate and uh, would gladly answer those questions or try to answer those. There are not a lot of blue side trainings on the web, except for a wide range of science courses. Uh, but, uh, you know, those cost a tons of money. Uh, so, is there a place for another player? I believe so. So, the defensive security uh, well known for their offensive courses. So, they created a lot of courses on uh, 100 level. 100 level is their junior level and uh, SOC 200, uh, which means it should be on at least uh, middle level. So, <coughs> I believe it's a middle level, but nothing more. Uh, their PAN 200 and OSCP certificate is well known and uh, and valued. Uh, so it just makes me wonder if it's not overvalued, um, if SOC 200 and PAN 200 are on the same level. So if level 200 is not so great, so who is it for? Mm, in my opinion, for the person on the brink of moving from junior to analyst to middle, or someone who's looking at specific knowledge they know they lack it uh, or f might be for you know the offensive side you know looking for some fundamentals of, of blue side how to better understand you know their uh, evasion techniques and so on are there any other competitors on the market which doesn't cost a lot of money I don't know, maybe uh, I recently heard about the Blue Team certificate, uh, which is also, as the name says, Blue Team and technical, but you know, it's also not that advanced, I believe. Uh, it's for the mid, not for the senior. Maybe something from Comptia. Uh, I plan to take it at some point in time so maybe i'll give you a review but still it, it's hard to find you know not very specific subject blue team matters uh, which doesn't cost a huge sum of money okay so what are the advantages mm, uh, of this training from the well-known organization um the knowledge is condensed chosen very well and well organized I mean, you know, sure, some of those, uh, sure, you probably have already known, but you know, uh, as uh, you know, buying and taking such certificate uh, and training, I believe it's important to get the foundation, foundational knowledge. So it's nice to even scroll down something that you knew, you know, to look for something that you might understand the other way and missed something or just have no one told you about this because you know you are a self-learner so something you might miss and second advantage and i believe the most important is that uh, with a learn one subscription uh, you get a whole year of all level 100 of six courses this is great but remember even if you briefly I uh, just want to get it through it briefly uh, because it's really a basic knowledge and uh, most of it you probably know. Uh, uh, still demands a lot of time. So if there is a subject that you truly don't know because you don't do anything with it, but still you would like, you know, to broaden your skills, maybe not skills, but you know, the knowledge and understanding of some subjects, those, uh, those, uh, there is a lot of this 100 level courses and uh, I believe they are worth to take it. 
Meanwhile, I'll show you some videos from the labs I took so you can estimate how much important and how much a hassle is, you know, how it actually works. Uh, so the labs are fine, especially, you know, this, the challenge ones, those uh, rather, um, the, you know, first labs are not that interesting, you know, they are get more interesting when they provide with more knowledge, so you can just uh, use it in rather more real life situation. But you know, labs are fine if they work. It's often that it doesn't work or it's so slow that makes you angry. Uh, I lost two Saturday mornings on lab that wouldn't start and uh, when started, it would fail to generate a new threat artifact after some time. Uh, I don't know if you feel it, but you know, uh, let's, let's say it makes you really angry, especially on your weekday, weekend when you arrange with yourself, with everyone else concerned, you are dedicated to learning and you know, you have just the feeling that you wasted your Saturday morning where you should rest. Okay, next thing is 24 hours exam. It, uh, you know, I mean, it uh, it lasts 24 hours, but you don't have to be all the time uh, by the computer screen, by the camera. Um, but what is important? Uh, it takes a lot of energy. Sure. Though we can sleep, still it takes a lot of energy. Uh, Offsex support is not always helpful and it often takes a lot of time. I, I mean, I believe it depends, you know, what, who your proctor would be, you know, if, if you try on a good person, it will be faster and more helpful. You know, the technical support is very busy. Uh, it, it might be, you know, it might take your time from the exam which is often at night. On the good side, you can sleep, but you have to be present at the exam start, uh, while it might be hard to book exam start, uh, which is in your time zone. I started my, my training and, and took the exam uh, close to the end of the year, so so it might be, you know, the quite hectic time because the companies probably have to spend, you know, the training foundings that time. Okay, what else about the exam? Uh, exam result is binary. I mean, you got all the info you passed or did not. We've now actually detailed feedback. Uh, you know, about such uh, failures, um, uh, offsec mind is that you should do all the apps. They, they saying is do it the hard way. Uh, but you know, sometimes checking your answer often doesn't work, so it tells you you are wrong while you are all fine and all right. Uh, if you are confident, you will post the answer two more times, uh, so the script uh, should really work and, you know, take some regex or something and, and, and say that you are right on the very same answer, you know, copy-paste. Uh, so, so it is important, you should be confident. But you know, if you're that confident in your answer, what is the reason actually for posting the answers? Uh, in most part, I skip those, those simple tests, uh, which are at the end of uh, most of the chapters. Uh, I only tried the test that, uh, that, you know, was at the end of the chapter that I felt I was rolling, uh, I was lacking. And I believe it would be beneficial for me to, you know, to try it. You know, it's quite irritating if you pay for the knowledge, even if they say learn the hard way. Uh, I believe if you want it hard way, it's, it's just better to get it for free with some tries and practice on your home lab and learning it on your own failures with, you know, with the only feedback from error messages. And last but not least, you just get, you know, the feeling of that everything works slow. Maybe it was, you know, just the end of the year and everything was heavy overloaded, but still you pay for it. There are a lot of disadvantages. The training demands great effort. 
and is not so cheap. I felt uh, I lack some basic structured knowledge of Windows and I got that. Rest of SOC 200 was quite easy for me, but uh, I'm long after you know leveling from junior, so so I was aware it probably will be like that. For me, it was not worth the money and the energy, as the exam was quite tiring. Had you know this feeling of wasting your Saturdays that I mentioned before. Um, okay, but uh, buying Claire One gives you a lot of uh, 100 level courses. And for me, it was the biggest advantage there. Uh, you can get a lot of basic knowledge on subjects you don't work with. Uh, it's quite well chosen and and uh, and put it in the right order. Knowledge. So if you get it in structured, uh, short, and well chosen way, it, it, it's worth you know to get some get some knowledge which which would you wouldn't find otherwise time for it. Okay, so what's my opinion and, and my belief? Uh, is it worth the money and your time even if you're on junior position and want to move uh, higher in ranks and your knowledge and understanding? Uh, or you are maybe an offensive one looking for some solid defensive side knowledge? In my opinion, not. Uh, or at least not for more than $2,600. I mean, there are sometimes, you know, some Black Friday or something, but still uh, the discount is too small, I believe. At 2,600, uh, it's about three to two, four times overpriced, if you ask me. So in my opinion, not, it's not worth it. I wasted a lot of time starting the labs so those would fail without even sign. For example, machines were working, but you know, no artifacts were generated. In my opinion, you can get better quality trainings uh, elsewhere. Tell me if if you agree with my opinion about uh, uh, SOC 200. If you took it, uh, tell me your opinion about the other trainings and exams. Uh, I will gladly inspire with your experience what is worth and not worth to you know invest your time and money.